On April 20th, 2023, SpaceX attempted its first orbital launch test of the so-called Super Heavy Starship, which ended in failure when the rocket exploded mid-flight. The Starship did successfully take off and perform a separation, but the almost four-minute flight ended in a delightfully euphemistic, rapid, unscheduled disassembly. In more colloquial terms, it blowed up real good. Additionally, the actual launch pad suffered a lot of damage as the 33 engines blasted the concrete into debris that went flying and caused additional damage around the launch site. The launch had been highly anticipated as the Starship is the largest and most powerful rocket ever built, and it is intended to revolutionize space access. More specifically, it's a linchpin of Elon Musk's stated intention to start a sustainable human colony on the planet Mars. Despite the result, neither the company nor industry observers see the flight as a failure, as the history of space flight is riddled with programs that have learned from explosive mistakes during test flights to reach their goals. SpaceX is proceeding with the preparation for the second attempted orbital launch of the Starship and is focusing on launch site readiness and upgrades to the rocket. For the second test, SpaceX will employ hot staging to separate the first and second stages of its Starship rocket. CEO Elon Musk announced these modifications on Twitter, stating that before test flight 2, SpaceX will make more than 1,000 improvements to the rocket. These include improvements to the Raptor engines, which are more difficult to operate than the Merlin engines used in the Falcon 9 spacecraft, but provide more power and require less maintenance. SpaceX has been conducting static fire tests to ensure that all 33 engines are running properly, and they have been upgrading the Orbital Launch Mount, or OLM, in preparation for the second flight. Since the April test launch, SpaceX has repaired the damage to the launch pad and deployed a new plate-based cooling system to direct heat from the rocket away from the launch site. The new setup also features a water deluge system to further deal with the inferno that is generated at launch time. Elon Musk has stated that the Starship will be ready to fly again by August, and SpaceX has filed a permit with the FCC requesting authorization for a second flight that is valid until December 15, 2023. It is unclear when the second attempted orbital launch site will actually take place, but SpaceX is proceeding with preparations for the event. In late July 2023, some cryogenic testing was done on the main Starship booster, so things are definitely moving along. During the first test flight, SpaceX gradually ramped up the Raptor engine thrust on the pad, which resulted in the Starship taking nearly 10 seconds to lift off, probably contributing to the launch pad damage. Elon Musk estimated a 50% chance for a successful test before the first launch, and he said that if the rocket gets, quote, far enough away from the launch pad before something goes wrong, then I think I would consider that to be a success. Just don't blow up the launch pad, unquote. So, despite the failure of the first launch, SpaceX remains committed to the Starship program and is continuing to work toward its goal of making humans a multi-planetary species. Please see the video description below for links with additional information. Thanks for watching.